question 91 from the following information calculate operating opening and closing trade receivables if trade receivables turnover ratio is three times here relate revenue from operations b rupees x total revenue from operations is equal to cost of revenue from operations plus gross profit gross profit and the informations are given now revenue from operations is equal to cost of revenue from operations plus it is written in the third part gross profit is 25 percent of the revenue from operations now it is cost of revenue from operations plus in place of gross profit you have to write down revenue from operations multiplied by 25 percent then write down the put the values that is x is equal to rupees 3 lakh plus x by 4 implies that rupees 3 lakh is equal to 4x minus x by 4 that is equal to rupees 3 lakh multiplied by 3 by 4x implies that x is equal to rupees 3 lakh multiplied by 4 by 3 implies that revenue from operations is rupees 4 lakh you can now test it you got rupees 4 lakh as revenue from operations 25 percent of this is rupees 1 lakh hence if you deduct 1 lakh out of this you will be getting 3 lakh is your cost of revenue from operations now this is fine till this point this is fine now let credit revenue from operations be y hence total revenue from operations is equal to cash revenue from operations plus credit revenue from operations implies that 4 lakh is equal to y by 3 plus y here it is written that cash revenue from operations is one third of credit revenue from operations implies that 4 lakh is equal to 4 plus 3y by 3 implies that rupees 4 lakh is equal to 4y by 3 implies that rupees 4 lakh multiplied by 3 by 4 is equal to y implies that y is equal to rupees 3 lakh y is credit revenue from our operations you can say this credit revenue from operations is rupees 3 lakhs now trade receivables turnover ratio is equal to credit revenue from operations upon average trade receivables that is equal to 3 is equal to implies that 3 is equal to rupees 3 lakh upon average trade receivables implies that average trade receivable is equal to rupees 1 lakh now let opening trade receivables be z here average trade receivable is equal to opening trade receivable plus closing trade receivables by 2 that is implies that rupees 1 lakh is equal to z plus 4z by 2 why that is 4z it is written that 3 times more 3 times plus 1 time that is 4 times 3 times m o r e remember if this word is skipped out then you lost everything z plus 4z by 2 em, implies that rupees 2 lakh is equal to 5z implies that z is equal to rupees 2 lakh by 5 implies that opening trade receivable is rupees 40,000 therefore closing trade receivable is 4z that is rupees that is 4 into rupees 40,000 that is rupees 1 lakh 60,000 